Today, we're gonna to be talking about everything you need to know about pocket squares. We're gonna be talking about when to wear them, why you wear them. Um, we're gonna do two or three different folds that are really basic and easy to add to any outfit. When to wear pocket squares? Weddings. Prom. When you're wearing a blazer. Date night. When you're wearing a suit. <laughs> when you're, basically when you're wearing a jacket with a pocket up here. Oh, also, when you buy a suit, make sure you cut the stitching out of here. Please, yeah, and always start from the inner end because it's always open. So, the pocket square, I mean, the style you have on you right now is it's almost just like a disheveled look. It's really, really simple on how to fold a pocket square like this, which basically, you just want to open it up Grab it by the middle, and then just kind of run your run your hands through here, and uh, then lift up and adjust. And um, you know this may take a few tries to get it right, but uh, once you get it like this, you just want to stick it in, and then kind of pull apart from there. And then basically this is how this look comes perfect. about. Yeah, there's no perfect way. All you want to do is make sure that the pocket square is sitting nice in inside your pocket. Right, you wanna, I mean, you wanna make sure it's well spread out and like it's not bunched in one yes. spot. I mean, there's there's a million different ways to fold a pocket square. As long as it's not hanging out, you just right. want it to fit, you know, you wanna look proper, you wanna be good. And uh, so, I mean, explain how you have the square fold right here. Square fold. So This really is simple. like classy, madman, yeah, you know, really every. Uh, this right here, basically you just get your classic pocket square. This, this is how I do it. I okay. fold it into four. You know, it's still a little wide. I break it off a bit. <laughs> this is me again. And I just nice gently place it inside. Okay. Or, sorry about that, you place it inside. Yeah. Simple, classic. Either, I mean, either or. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes, if, if the pocket square is big enough, you can even overlap it. And it looks kind of cool, because it gives it like, like it's not perfect. So if your suit is cut just right, and you know, your, your suit is on point, this will give it that little, a little edge to, to let people know that you know you're you're not being pompous, you know. Right, right. right. The you beauty know? and imperfection. Yeah, there you go. That's, that's that's my opinion. Definitely. I mean, that's that's a different way than I I fold a square pocket. How do you do it? Show me. Um, so basically, I do it close to a similar way, but I uh, I fold it into thirds, however however wide said jacket is, mm -hmm. and then I fold it over so the the shorter part is is on the bottom. So it only shows the top, the top fold through. This is actually the, the correct way. Yeah, this is this is how. I mean, not the correct way, but. I mean, this is this is the way that tutorials will tell yes, you. Yes, yes. There's no right way to do it. There's exactly. no wrong way to do it. As long as it looks good, not out of place. You don't want to call too much attention, yes. but it is it is the part of your suit where you get to, you know, you get to exaggerate you your have style fun. Yeah. exactly because it's it's small. It's like a small accent. Like if you had any of these prints on a jacket or something, it would be way too loud. And you wouldn't wear a pocket square. I guess, and the different types of pocket squares are good for different occasions, you know, like floral, probably more springtime, weddings, you know, happy, yes. you know, things like that. And maybe a hound's tooth would be more elegant. Yeah, more, more classic. You, you could even do a camel if you, you know, if you, if you want to, if you want to feel a little more youthful. It's like a younger. different, you know. yeah. or just, you know, you want to go with the guys and you don't want to be. Right, right, right. You know, this exactly. Is it. Or if you want to, if you, you want to, hunt, you know, if you don't want anyone suit. to see you. <laughs> also, another important thing to note is you never want to match your tie to your pocket square in color, fabric, or pattern. So you want to, you want to really differentiate. I mean, you see on Blake, he's got. The blue tie with polka dots, the woven woven silk, and then the pocket square here is what's this Japanese denim you said? Yeah, classic. And I'm not even I'm not even wearing a tie today. Yeah, but, but so George can match his shirt with his pocket square because he's not wearing a tie. Right. See, so he has that Bradley Cooperish, you know. <laughs> that, he has <laughs> that feel to him. <laughs> You're too kind. Yeah. We want to send a special thank you to Airy Rose for supplying all our pocket squares today. Thank you. Make sure you check out his website and look at all the links below. So today we showed you two basic ways to fold a pocket square. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen many other ways. Be sure to tag us in pics you see of maybe squares you wanna see folded and we'll do a little video on how to fold those. And uh, be sure to like, subscribe, uh, comment maybe what folds you'd like to see. And uh, be sure to follow us on Instagram, at Jenslounge, and uh, check out jenslounge.com. Thanks.